There are different types of brushes in Illustrator. Calligraphic, scatter, art, pattern and bristle brushes. So let's take a look at each one of those types in a bit more detail. So first the calligraphic brushes. Well, they create strokes that resemble those uh, drawn with the angled point of a calligraphic pen and they are drawn along the center of the path. And they look like the ones you can see right here. The most distinct feature of these brushes is the varying width of the stroke. It's pretty much the same effect you can achieve uh, using the width tool, uh, which we'll talk about later in the series, by the way. Now next up we got scatter brushes, which disperse copies of an object, such as uh, maybe like a ladybug or a leaf or a balloon along the path. Next up we got art brushes, which stretch a brush shape, such as a rough uh, charcoal or object shape, evenly along the length of the path, and they basically look like these paintbrush strokes right here. We also have bristled brushes, which create brush strokes with the appearance of a natural brush with bristles. And if you want to add pattern fills to your freeform paths, use the pattern brush. Now, they quite often can produce similar results to the scatter brushes. However, pattern brushes follow the path exactly, while scatter brushes do not. So these are the types of brushes you can find inside Illustrator and in the next video we'll take a look at the paintbrush tool options.